Are you an aspiring Salesforce administrator looking to stand out in the competitive world of Salesforce? Well, you have come to the right place. In today's video, we'll be exploring a question that might many of you have. Which Salesforce certification are the most valuable for Salesforce administrators? We will be break down the key Salesforce certifications designed specifically for administrators going into the unique benefits of each certification brings. But before we jump in, make sure to hit the subscribe button for valuable content. Now let's get started with the video. First certification that an admin should do is, of course, we all know that it is Salesforce Administrator Certification. As for this certification, there is no prerequisite and it is like the starting point for admin job. It shows you the no basic things about Salesforce like handling users, keeping things secure and using automations and reports. You can think of it as your license to drive in the Salesforce world. But why does it matter? Basically, this certification proves you are serious about the using Salesforce. Plus, if you get it, you can go for more advanced certification as well. This certification will help you learn the main concepts in Salesforce like setting up users, making things secure, customizing, automating, and creating reports and handling data. Now, second certification that you should target as an admin is Salesforce Advanced Administrator Certification. This is the certification for seasoned admins, those who have mastered the art of using advanced features to solve business problems. And this certification dives deep into advanced features, customization, and automation. Why is it important? Because it shows you, you can handle tricky stuff in Salesforce and fix tricky business issues. This certification will help you learn advanced customization, automation with flows, data management, sandboxes, integration, and performance optimization. Now, in order to get this certification, you should need to have Salesforce Certified Administrator Certification and at least six months of hands-on admin experience. Moving on third certification that you should aim for as an admin would be Platform App Builder. If you are someone who dreams of building custom apps within Salesforce, then this is the certification you should go with as it will enhance you with the skills to turn those dreams into reality. But why is it important? Because it proves you can extend Salesforce functionality without code catering to a specific business needs. This cert makes you a valuable asset for any organization. It will help you learn about building apps with Lightning App Builder, components, layouts, integration, and security consideration. Talking about its prerequisite, you don't need prior coding experience, but basic Salesforce knowledge is recommended. Now, these three certifications are more than sufficient to validate your skill set as a Salesforce administrator. However, we all know that the demand of Salesforce administrators in India is not very high and many individuals aspire for career growth beyond this road. So after obtaining these certifications, it's time to consider two distinct paths. Path A is for people who enjoy programming, coding, solving technical challenges and creating custom applications. On the other hand, Path B is for people who possess strong business understanding, communication skills and an interest in translating business needs into practical Salesforce solutions. Identify yourself which one you want to go to with. If you choose Path A, then this will lead to the role like Salesforce Developer, Integration Specialist or Solution Architect. And if you choose Path B, this path will open doors to career like Salesforce Business Analyst or Business Process Consultant. For Path A, you can further specialize by obtaining certifications like Platform Developer 1, Platform Developer 2 or pursue specialized skills certifications like an CS4 CPQ specialist depending on desired demand. For Path B, you can opt for certifications like a CS4 Business Analyst certification or you can consider refining your expertise in specific cloud with certifications like Sales Cloud or Service Cloud Consultant. So that's all you need to know about which certification you should go get as a beginner. If you want to learn in detail about each certification, let us know in the comment section and we will create a dedicated playlist covering all the certifications. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more amazing content. Thanks for joining and see you in the next one.